Yo, Liz. Now he's in our house. Hey, come on in. All right. I made some chocolate chip cookies and I left them on the table. Just take a seat. I'll be right there. That's fine. No problem. Mmm, these are good. You like them? Mmm. I made them all by myself. I can't wait to see you. I know. Online, he said he'd bring alcohol and condoms, so the actress asks him about it. What kind of alcohol did you bring? Um, I brought Absolute Citron, I brought Mandarin Orange, I brought a shot of Jägermeister, I got, uh, Bush. Wow! And, yeah. um, I don't know, I could get some more if I need to. Did you bring condoms? Mm-hmm. Food. Well, with all that, it sounds like you've got a pretty big night planned, huh? Yep. I feel horrible that I did this. But that heartfelt speech, those words of wisdom, won't help him this time around. Please get down the ground! Get down the ground! Like all the other men you've seen, he's patted down, photographed, and his car is searched. Knowing that my cat follows me everywhere. I think he likes me. What do you think, Dink? I will help out any animal that needs assistance. You know what I mean? What do you think, Dink? I think he says... I, I watched Forrest Gump three times in a row, and I know every single word from the very beginning all the way to the very end. I haven't traveled in probably about five years, but I still want to travel. I don't know where, but with you, it could be possible, I guess, you know. I love to cook, and I love to eat, and I love to... Uh, I love any dogs, any cats, any animals. I actually take care of cats and dogs and other animals, too. Like two donkeys. Good evening. Uh, this is Eric uh, for Eric for Paws. Um, I do feed cats uh, and donkeys and dogs. Um, anyways, um, uh, hit the like button and also subscribe to me. Uh, we can talk more about the, um, the nutritional value of a cat. And uh, I'm also available in uh, Palm Beach County um, for feeding animals. Um, so give me a, a like and uh, also give me your comments too. Uh, we could talk more about whatever you decide um, because this is kind of like your channel and not mine. So anyways, um, I'm an open book and uh, available 24-7. Thank you. Hey y'all, again, this is Eric with Eric for Paws. Um, I just want to let you know that every night at 11 o'clock uh, Eastern Standard Time, uh, I will share a few little ideas and uh, comments of you guys. And hopefully I could get on live if that's really necessary. Other than that, you guys are good to go. Uh, hit the like and the subscribe button, uh, give me your comments, and also uh, stay safe. Bye. Hey y'all, uh, it's Eric for Paws, welcome. Um, it's about 11 o'clock, um, I knew I would say I would post something at every night at 11, um, so I'm here, uh, like and subscribe to my channel. Um, if you have any questions or ideas or comments, um, please uh, let me know um, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. But my saying goes is that every uh, four paws gets food, um, no matter if they're running around uh, hungry or if they're a nuisance or anything like that, uh, they always deserve something. Uh, because they're weaker than we are. Um, and I do feed uh, 50 cats 
every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from 3 o'clock until 7. Um, and I always spend time with them and stuff like that. Um, I'll send you guys some uh, pictures of uh, the uh, routes I take and stuff like that. Um, and we feed uh, probably like two big uh, five copper or a copper like scoops and stuff like that with uh, two cans of cat food um, for each 28 cats um, which is actually more than enough um, and they get fed once a day so that's pretty cool and I'm in Palm Beach County uh, the western part uh, near Pahokee, Belglade and uh, Port Mayaka um, and near Lake Okeechobee that's in Florida, uh, but I can always drive east to Wellington, Loxahatchee Groves, Loxahatchee, Royal Palm, uh, Lake Worth, or even up into Palm Beach Gardens or Palm Beach Gardens Farms. Uh, so anyways, um, hope to hear that you're doing well. Um, uh, and my cat, he's actually dead asleep. Uh, he's actually, uh, uh, he, he got up at like four o'clock in the morning. So that's cool. But anyways, uh, like and subscribe and, um, hope to hear from you soon. And I'll text you back as soon as possible. Uh, 24, 7, 365 days out of the year. Uh, also, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, okay, thanks. Appreciate it. Hey, welcome to Eric for Pause. My name is Eric. Pleasure to meet you all. Um, my cat's doing pretty good. Uh, his name is Dinky. Say hi, Dinky. Hi. Anyways, um, just wanted to talk a little bit about the uh, feeding aspect of a cat and uh, of a dog. Um, I'm very interested in knowing, uh, especially for organic and also for um, regular. I don't think fish really actually suits a cat um, unless if they're very feral. Um, I know that, uh, for instance, if you are, uh, organic or even, um, non-GMO and if you are, cats are sometimes when they eat too much fish, they're actually allergic to that kind of stuff, you know? Oh, by the way, um, subscribe and, uh, hit the like button and, uh, uh, you're, you're saving actually pause, uh, for pause, um, no matter if it's a cat, dog, um, other miscellaneous, uh, animals, um, uh, even birds, um, uh, they actually kind of have like pause, you know, in general. Um, so anyways, uh, we're just having a good old time. Um, and what else? Uh, I feed my cat, um, organic cat food. Um, and he's actually allergic to rice, which is kind of crazy. So, uh, right now he is actually drinking his water. Uh, he has purified water. Um, you know, city water doesn't really help that much. Um, but I'm not, uh, point pinpointing, you know, inaccurate things about city water. City water kind of sucks down in South Florida, you know, um, but I want to know your comments and your questions, um, and everything else like that. Um, nutrition is actually very good. Um, beyond is very good. Uh, wellness is also good. And all, all the other miscellaneous, uh, cat, uh, foods are good too as well. So anyways, um, yeah, hit the like button, hit the, uh, subscribe button and, uh, Put down your questions and comments and concerns. Uh, I'd like to know more about you in general. Thank you. Bye. Well, good evening. Welcome to Eric for Paws. I do start at 11 o'clock at night, every night, uh, as a little short video. Like and subscribe uh, to my channel. 
Um, and every pod deserves a, a second chance. Um, anyways, uh, the question tonight, um, it's not from anybody in particular, but, um, my question is what's the earliest a kitten can be on its own? Um, I rescued a kitten in front of my house. Um, not too long ago in between a median, uh, in a bush. And, uh, there was a bunch of, uh, I guess tree trimmers. I'm not going to mention their names or anything. Uh, but anyways, um, what's the earliest that a kitten can be on its own? Uh, we were feeding it, uh, regular kitten food and, um, we had to feed it like three times a day. And the cat kitten got adopted uh, through uh, Peggy Adams. Thank you, Peggy Adams. You deserve a thumbs up, always. Um, so, yeah, what's the earliest a kitten can be on its own? That's my question to you tonight. Um, if there's any questions in regards to kittens, cats, dogs, four-legged animals um it could be even fish you know um it could be birds birds can be considered as four paws technically speaking with their wings and stuff like that um so it's pretty cool anyways um what else um my cat's here just laying down he's like so freaking tired i think it was up at six o'clock this morning um i heard him like play with his toy and stuff so it was pretty cool but uh thank you again all paws deserve a thumbs up and uh rescuing is number one uh for every animal um sometimes they rescue you you know, so like, subscribe, and uh, just be the best you can. Over and out. Bye. Hello. Welcome to Eric for Pause. My name is Eric. Hi. Um, anyways, uh, I did think I posted something earlier about like within the last minute and a half two minutes but um i just wanted to give everybody a heads up to like and subscribe to my channel and i'll i'll follow you back too um and then also not only that but i hope that everybody's having a great tuesday um i've been kind of going through a lot of stuff but uh but i'm, I'm i seem very uplifting you know and stuff like that so uh but anyways um about kittens kittens with their mom uh how often do they get fed milk um is it once twice three times four times um 12 times 100 times a day um i know when they're first born they have to stay extremely close to their mom but once when they hit one two and three weeks i don't really know how often they do give milk um because actually it's a very very uh intricate thing for a mom and the, her kittens or a clouder to actually become part of uh or actually her litter i'm sorry clouder is actually a group of kittens or cats that are actually feral or non-feral. That's like a massive amount that always, are always hanging out, you know? So anyways, um, that's a good insight. Um, anyways, um, but yeah, just give me, um, you know, some ideas of like what you've experienced with any paws, um, no matter if it's dog, cat, animal, scales um fish you know stuff like that um frogs you know um 
it could be amphibious or, or not. I mean, everything has a paw, you know, technically speaking, even birds. So that's pretty cool. Anyways, uh, that's it for tonight. Um, just ask your questions and I'll get back to you. But like and subscribe to my channel. All right. Talk to you later. Bye now. See you later. Hello, welcome to Eric for Paws. Um, it's going to be kind of short, kind of sweet, kind of in the groove for things, I guess you could say. Um, for dogs, when is a dog able to sweet, wean away from its mother? or from its uh, father or siblings. I don't really know for sure. That's a good idea. Um, but anyways, hey, if you want to do something for me, like and subscribe on the channel. Um, and I'll try to do live also as well. Um, but anyways, um, yeah, puppies. Uh, when do they wean away from their mother, their father, or even their siblings? Um, that's a good question. I don't really know the answer. Um, I know that when I was actually in uh, a dog rescue, we rescued a lot of animals. And actually, there was some uh, puppies that were actually put up for adoption. Um, and they were considered, um, they were like, like short, a little short dog. Um, and actually, I think they were, um, what else? They're English. Also, I can't think what they're called. But if you know the name, type it in. I want to know. You know? So anyways, um, I hope that's pretty much where it is, you know? Um, but yeah, uh, what would you do for your pet if they had a kitten, a dog, a kitten, a puppy, or even a, I don't know, whatever kind of little one there is, you know, so, uh, it's open to all. Hello, welcome for Eric for Paws. Tonight, we will be talking about everything on the face of the planet, and then also, hit that, hit that like button, um, and share it with all your friends, um, so I can actually go live. Um, every night at 11 o'clock, we're going to be doing the same thing. So, anyways. Um, tell me a story about your pet. Um, I'm breaking the ice a little bit from the original times of dogs, cats, you know, everything. Let me, let me know about your pet, you know, and everything that you do for them. Um because actually it'd be very beneficial and very energetic and everything else in between. So subscribe and hit the like button. I like that. You know, um, last night I didn't even post anything because I actually fell asleep early. And, uh, but I'm actually late tonight because actually I was sleeping with my cat. So, Anyways, but other than that, um, so yeah, tell me a story about your pet, uh, what they're all about, you know, um, maybe I can actually help. I haven't posted any pictures of the cats that I feed, uh, Monday was Mondays, one, uh, Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, um, and or Saturdays and Sundays or Anytime in between. See, I am tired. Um, 
But anyways, um, yeah, so tell me a story about your pet. Um, and maybe I can help, you know. Um, but anyways, subscribe. Like. And I'll like you back. And we can talk. And stuff like that. So anyways, I uh, hope you have a great night. And uh, stay safe. And uh, it's the weekend. So um, we'll talk soon. Thank you. And you know what to do. Save a paw. Save a pet. Peace. Hello. Welcome to Eric for Paws. It is 11 o'clock on the dot. Yay. Anyways. Um. About your pets and stuff like that, I was just wondering, like, what kind of stuff do you like to, uh, like, to do with your pet, you know? Um, whether it be, you know, playing around, you know, having fun and excitement. Actually, pets do need activity, um, a lot of times, um, probably about an hour, maybe two, maybe three up to the whole 24-7, you know, unless if you're actually a stay-at-home parent, um, which is cool, um, hit the like button, too, also, and subscribe, because if you subscribe, you are saving a pet, um, anyways, um, I just wanted to, uh, bring that to your attention that all pets do need activity, um, which is actually cool. Um, I know dogs, um, they need activity probably three hours, four hours out of the day because most of the time they do sleep. Um, cats do sleep the same amount of time, um, but they're night owls. Um, dogs, they're actually, uh, active during the day but sleep at night usually so anyways um that's the thing um also it's great to walk a pet um or even train to walk a pet which is actually pretty cool because actually that's what I'm learning how to do for my cat Dinky because he's just He's one of those cats that if you let him go, he's gone for good, you know. Actually, he did escape one time, but he came back and um, he was just a great, you know, role model for everybody. So anyways, um, anyways, yeah, subscribe and also hit the like button. And I want to know your stories, too. Um, and that's the most important part. What is your story about your pet that you enjoy the most? Um, that's why I'm going to continue on from last night. Uh, anyways, thank you. You know what to do. Hit that like button and subscribe. Peace. Good evening. Welcome to Eric for Paws. It is 11.05. Uh, unfortunately, last night I was with a friend who was going through a difficult time uh, with her mother and her brothers and stuff like that. So I'm not going to mention her name, but um, she's doing a lot better now. Anyways, um, just wanted to give you a heads up that uh, last night I did, uh, yeah, that thing uh, with her and stuff like that. Um, it was more of like a uh, emotional support um, because actually people are kind of considered as pets as well, um, especially close people that you know who have anxiety, depression, and anything like that. But anyways, uh, Marissa actually brought up something very cool is that... Uh, cats do need uh, a lot of activity and she does play with the ball with her uh, with her cat um, at least you know a few hours out of the day so that's kind of cool 
Um, but yeah, with me and Binky, um, which he is sitting right here. Say hi, Dinky. He's the best boy in the world. He's just relaxing with his dad. Um, we're, we're just having a good old time, you know? Um, anyways, um, hit the like button and subscribe right down in the corner. The more you get to a thousand people, I guess, uh, the better off you are because actually you can actually save a pet. And also not only that, but I can go live. So that's a pretty cool thing. Um, anyways, um, so I do have a few photos. Um, if you actually want them, I will actually send them to you uh, about the cats that I do on a daily basis and uh, what type of food I use and stuff like that. So, and how many scoops I always use, um, which is actually pretty cool. Um, we use, uh, I think it's Friskies and also Friskies cat canned food. So that's pretty cool too as well. Um, and then I use, uh, the big Buffalo, uh, dog food for the dogs as well. So anyways, yeah, hit the like button and subscribe and do all that good stuff because you're saving a pet for sure. Anyways, uh, thank you. You know what to do. Just Hit me up later. Good evening. Uh, this is a 60-second 60, 60 video. Uh, welcome to Eric for Paws. Um, it is Tuesday at 11 o'clock or approximate that time. Hit the like button and subscribe. Uh, my mission is to feed as many uh, animals as possible. Um, and if you do have a pet within Palm Beach County that needs to be fed, I will definitely do it. Um, I've had training in, uh, aggressive to, uh, the most shyest one on the face of the planet. Uh, so anyways, yeah, my cat was just, uh, hanging with me tonight. Just a little twist on the camera. Uh, but uh, hopefully everyone is great and happy, and uh, let me know your story as well. All right? Good. Welcome to Eric for Paws. It is 11.06 on Wednesday evening, um, and this is my three-minute ordeal. Um, so anyways... Uh, about your pet feeding. Uh, how often do you feed your pet? Why do you feed your pet? And for what reasons do you feed your pet? Uh, oh, hit the like button. Because if you hit the like button, and I overheard this from somebody on TikTok, uh, that if you do 20 of those uh, that you will not be blocked for some strange reason. I don't know if that's true or not, but it could be possible. Anyways, um, but anyways, uh, talking about feeding your pet, uh, what type of food do you feed your pet? It could be anything in general. I mean, it could be even your own food, you know, and stuff like that. Um, and I'm just wondering, like, what... Uh, flavors do you feed your pet um, what type of activities you do to feed your pet and also if they are being good how often do you treat them uh, with treats or anything like that I feed my cat little greenies and stuff like that which is cool um, and then also soft food is twice a week on Thursday and also Sunday evening or Sunday morning. Um, anyways, uh, yeah, let me know what you like to feed your pet. Um, and I do have pictures uh, that are actually on my iPhone right now uh, that I can actually share with you uh, in a DM or whatever. So anyway... Uh, just let me know about that. Um, I do serve the West Palm Beach County. Uh, I do feed, walk, 
uh, change litter boxes and also uh, spend time house sitting, uh, especially for seniors as well. So, anyways, uh, yeah, so hit the like button. If you hit the like button, you're going to be awesome. And you save a pet. Uh, my mission is to save one paw is to save many. Thanks. And you know what to do?